Today, we're taking you out to the battlefield. Ever wonder what it's like to spot a target that's behind your back? What it means to aim a rifle at a terrorist dozens of meters away without being in the line of fire? Well, the Elbit System's RCAS system does exactly that, all while transferring the live feed up the chain of command. Join us for this close-up report by the defense reporter of Ynet, the largest online Israeli media outlet. An IDF force approaches a suspicious structure in the heart of the hostile area. The ARCAS system independently recognizes terrorists on the second floor, but the real danger for the warriors lurks underground. In complete darkness, they are required to identify the terrorists hiding in the underground maze and eliminate them without being exposed. A few meters ahead lies a terrorist group, which we identified as hostile targets through this site. The site operates even in underground areas like this, where there is no light to rely on, using thermal vision. In fact, the cross on the target allows shooting and hitting the hiding terrorist without even seeing him, even around the corner. This is a first inside look to an Elbit Systems technology which is expected to revolutionize the battlefield for infantry warriors. After developing smart helmets for helicopter pilots for the Israeli and American Air Force, a similar version of the system is adopted in the field. A miniaturized computer is integrated inside an assault rifle which detects an elusive enemy, automatically adjusts the target cross and increases the warrior's accuracy starting with the first bullet. What you see here is a demonstration of shooting from the hip. The soldier receives a feed projected directly to his eyes, displaying exactly what is seen through the thermal sight or the system input received by the day camera. He has the capability to shoot without getting into shooting position. He shoots from the hip without any problem. This is actually a fire control system that improves the warrior's shooting ability. The system takes into consideration all sorts of data, such as range and wind, depending on which sensors are mounted on the rifle and the optical capability of target size detection. By calculating the input, the system positions the sight's cross on the target and improves the soldier's shooting capabilities. Elbit defines this technology as the smartphone of the warrior's weaponry, with full communication and live data transfer between the soldiers and the commanders. The soldier controls the system with the joystick mounted on the front part of the rifle. This system allows the soldier, beyond the electronic capabilities of the viewed channels, a lot of AI capabilities. He has navigation navigation abilities. He can download or receive a mission outline and navigate with the help of this system. The system can identify sources of firing or movement. Combining all these capabilities with the soldier's constant connectivity to his teammates improve the soldier orientation and allow him to perform his mission in a much more effective way. The system transmits the footage from the thermal bolometric camera attached to the weapon directly to your eyes using the mounted eyepiece. That way you don't even need to get into shooting position as was required before. You can shoot from the hip around the corner or through the window without exposing yourself to the enemy. While entering a room in order to clear it, the soldier can just aim the weapon without exposing himself. After years of development and testing, Elbit's RCAS system allows immediate zeroing of the weapon without wasting time and long hours and ammunition at firing ranges. On your right-hand side, the system indicates that it has identified the target. It automatically calculates the distance from the target and the required position of the site for the zeroing process. Okay, can you see? Yes, that's it. This is the zeroing process. You press a button and you're done. Furthermore, the system changes the position of the cross to the right place so that the rifle is optimized to hit targets within a 20 meter CEP. What used to be a long process now takes the system only five seconds. Through the small sensors that were added to the rifle, the soldier knows at any given moment how many bullets are left in the cartridge before replacing it. The IDF, as well as foreign armies, show interest in the innovative development. Artificial intelligence, target size identification, applicable sustainability for the fighter's role, machine gunner, launcher operator, sniper, or marksman. These capabilities allow accuracy and combat engagement in accordance with the soldier's gear. Ultimately, the system must be very intuitive to the infantry warrior to improve his abilities and not add any difficulty. The system is very intuitive. You just turn it on and immediately start operating it. This is the concept we deliver. 
RCAS revolutionizes the battlefield as we know it. Where catching a terrorist is determined by a fraction of a second, RCAS makes every bullet count. Adjusting the sights cross with a simple tap on the joystick, zeroing a weapon without wasting ammunition, or even allowing a soldier to make an impossible shot when shielded out of harm's way is exactly what it takes to nail a mission. Any infantry soldier can mount RCAS at the front of the rifle, mark the target, and fire.